Okay, we're here tonight for the Marilyn Monroe event. Um, it's both of our first night. It's something that Colonial Jewelers does every year. It's for a great cause. You can't go wrong dressing up like Marilyn. What do you think, Isla? Um, we are raising money for the Breast Cancer Foundation, for the Horowitz Foundation. Um, Patty is actually a survivor, so this is really close to her heart, and we're all really glad to be a part of it. Yeah, so it's going to be a lot of people in the community coming out to support a great cause, dress up, and watch a great movie, Gentlemen Prefer Blondes. So we're really excited to be here. <laughs> Hi, I'm Brayden Morrison. I'm here at Colonial Jewelers for their breast cancer uh, fundraiser. I am the, uh, the artist of the Marilyn Monroe mosaic. Um, if you'd like to contact me, I do pieces upon commission. Uh, you can contact me at Brayden Morrison at yahoo.com, B-R-A-U-G-H-A-N-M-O-R-R-I-S-O-N. Thank you. It's so great to be here at Colonial Jewelers. It, this event is so much fun. I've been looking forward to it for months. We are having the best time. Thank you so much. <laughs> Hi, my name is Marley. I've been working at Colonial Jewelers for about a year now. I absolutely love it. I feel like part of the family, and I'm having such a good time at the event. Go, Marilyn. It's wonderful to be at Colonial Jewelers tonight um, to celebrate women and Marilyn Monroe and to attempt to break the world's record for the most Marilyn Monroes in one spot. This is all a benefit, a great benefit for breast cancer research and um, cancer research overall. And I give so much credit to the Hurwitz Foundation for what they have done and what they will continue to do in Frederick County and throughout the state and the nation for their efforts and in helping to support a cause that is so important to all of us on every level of our community. It's a great night to be here and wish it wasn't so rainy, but we're having a good time. That's all that matters. So this is our fourth annual Girls Night Out, um, second year for Marilyn Monroe. We have, I think, about 150 Marilyns um, all wandering around town. They'll be arriving here shortly um, the, en masse for the um, wine reception and then heading on the red carpet down to the Weinberg Center to watch the iconic movie, Gentlemen Prefer Blondes. And of course, the famous song for that movie is Diamonds Are a Girl's Best Friend. So that works really well for us. Um, it's a fun night out for the girls, but most importantly, it's a fundraiser for the Hurwitz Breast Cancer Fund, which of course is a really important women's cause. So it's women having fun for a good cause for women. It's, it's great, great to, to be, be here, here tonight. At Colonial Jewelers, Jewelers for tonight. the Marilyn Monroe <laughs> event. I'm so happy to be here tonight to support the Hurwitz Breast Cancer Fund. Hi, I'm Terry Perry. I'm very thrilled to be here to support the Breast Cancer Fund. Okay. One more time. It's great to be here. It's great to be here at Colonial Jewelers. It's great to be here at Colonial Jewelers. I'm having a great time at Colonial Jewelers. Okay. One, two, three. We love Maryland. Happy birthday, President! <laughs> it's great to be here at Colonial Jewelers. It's so great being here tonight at Colonial Jewelers. The crowd, it looks so amazing. Every woman is dressed to kill. What do you think, Marie? I think it's wonderful. It's always great to spend time at Colonial Jewelers. It's great to be here at Colonial. I see another picture of nine. She's got her hand up. Here, so it's really, really important stuff here. Thank you again, everyone, for coming tonight. And thank you to Patty Hurwitz and the Hurwitz Breast Cancer Fund. And Colonial Jewelers. And then thank you to all the restaurants that I think are listed on your program. But um, I want to introduce our awesome judges tonight. We have the president of Hood College, Ron Volpe. <laughs> Jeff Hurwitz. Tom, Le 
Tom Lynch, Richard Griffin, Scott Grove, Tom Klein Hansel, and Rick Adams wimped out and went home because it was past his bedtime. So um, we are going to turn it over to Ron Bowlby, who's going to um, explain the awards process. And so, Ron, take it from here. Well, thank you very much, Carlos. And let me, uh, on behalf of all of the judges, thank each and every one of you for participating. It was a very, very challenging and difficult uh, event for us to uh, evaluate all of these beautiful young ladies. Uh, and we want to thank uh, Sadie, who was our photographer right. and our statistician. And uh, we want to assure you uh, we acted with the highest degree of integrity and honesty. And, uh, and now what we'd like to do is first bring up uh, five individuals who got the eye of all the judges. We'd like to bring you up one at a time. We'll call off the number, and we'd invite you up, and then we will make the final announcement. So uh, number one, and these are not in rank order. They're just five wonderful candidates. Uh, first of all, number six, would you please come forward? Number six. And by the way, the judges were out there arguing. I mean, they were really almost in arm wrestling mode because it went on and on and on. And number six is Erica Brown. Congratulations, number six. like to invite up number nine, number nine. And number nine is Samantha Sisson. Samantha? Congratulations, Samantha. Next, we would like to invite up number 12, number 12. Rona Mesma, Rona Mensa. Congratulations, Rona. Great job, Rona. Next, we'd like to invite up number 13. Number 13, Melinda Dorigan. Melinda Donigan. I'm sorry, Melinda. Melinda Donigan. Number 13. And our fifth finalist is number 15. Terry Perry, number 15, Terry Perry. Now, before we announce the grand winner, we have a special winner up here, a special category that the judges just felt we had to create. And that is a winner is uh, Rona Mensa receives the <laughs> You Got Guts Award and Heart and Soul. <laughs> the, the Heart and Soul Award. Congratulations, hon. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations. Great job. Great job, honey. Great job. Great job. Great job. There's, there's, Great job. there's no crown for that. Thank you, Mr. Volby. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. President. <laughs> when is your birthday? January. Well, it'll be today, but it's tonight. Tonight is your birthday. Happy birthday. Nobody wants to hear that. Sing it with you. Great job, Great job. Well, 
Congratulations, Rona. Thank you. Well, congratulations. Thank you. All right. Oh. And congratulations to all the runners-up. You yeah. all did a you great job, great. and great. everybody great. did. Yeah. Thank you. Hey, and, and next year will be Elizabeth Taylor. So get ready for that. Yeah. Cat on a hot tin roof. Cat on a hot tin roof. Maybe <laughs> we don't know. So thank you again. I'm so flattered. I had no idea. I'm just touched. I'm touched. Oh. I'm touched. I had, I had no idea. I'm just so touched. I'm just, I'm just out for the weekend. I had no idea. Thank you so much, Melinda Donegan. Thank you. Thank you. We're so happy to be here. Oh. Now you're supposed to talk. Congratulations to Melinda. Um, we're so happy to be here to support breast cancer. It's a great event, so much fun. I'm definitely coming back next year. As Elizabeth Taylor. Yeah. <laughs> and shout out to my mom for bringing me. Hey, love you. Mother's Day. Went away. But when you get up there, the judges will hand the people that look the most like the room and heading out. <laughs> Yeah. 
Just goes to show.